Whilst there was a public uproar on the cost of dialysis per session, even those who can afford were finding it difficult to access the service at the Konfanochi Teaching Hospital due to insufficient machines. The Chief Executive Officer of the hospital, Professor Otriade Mensa, in February, described the situation as disheartening. We at Konfanochi presently have, I usually say, one and a half dialysis machines. And it's because one is working at full capacity, the other is working at fault. And so what it means is that we are no longer able to receive patients from outside for dialysis. For each dialysis session, it takes four hours. And so what it means is that if you have two dialysis machines in house and you have, say, five patients who need dialysis, what it means is that if uh, God does not intervene, then by the time it gets to the turn of the fifth person, uh, he probably would have popped off. But it appears there will soon be a relief as the hospital takes steps to secure some additional machines to make dialysis services more accessible. Presently we have four, thanks to Springfield, Springfield Oil. But the hospital again uses internally generated funds and has purchased three brand new dialysis machines, which you saw, uh, the installation is being done. Um, I'm expecting two brand new ones, uh, possibly by the end of this month. So this seems to be a good news for persons who come here at the Konfanochi Teaching Hospital for dialysis services, as the hospital has taken that initiative to increase the number of dialysis machines they have. And this is expected to improve the services they render here. Management of the hospital is also intervening in securing accommodation for relatives of patients who travel far to Kumasi to seek medical treatment for their sick family at the hospital. For most of these relatives, their only option is to sleep in the open due to their inability to afford accommodation. Management and the board of the hospital inspected a 190-bed hostel facility meant for the relatives of patients. Uh, much as um, our core mandate as a hospital does not essentially include the provision of such services for relatives. To the extent that some of these patients uh, would definitely come with relatives because of the states in which they find themselves, uh, it has become necessary for us to make that kind of provision. The hospital has also renovated its physiotherapy department as part of its retooling process to enhance medical care.